That summer sun can make you sweat. So it's time for the DIY Cooler Chiller. For this project, you're going to need a cheap styrofoam cooler of, without the cat tux get out of there and i picked up an inexpensive 12 volt powered fan the first step is to place the fan face down on the top of the cooler then i used a sharpie to trace around the fan but on the inside of the outer edge of the fan then using a razor i cut around the outline cut a little bit less because you can always cut more and ended up with a hole in the top of the cooler test fit the fan it should fit snug inside that hole in my box of plumbing parts i found two one and a quarter inch 90 degree elbows these will serve as our exhaust ports, and I'll mount one on each side of the cooler. Again, tracing around and making an outline, and then cutting that hole smaller than the outline, you'll have a nice snug fit, and you should have to turn it a few times to make sure it fits in nice and tight. Both of our exhaust ports are installed in our cooler chiller. While these are snug, they're loose enough to tilt up or down depending on where you want your cold air flow. Our cold air source is gonna be a block of ice, so I found an appropriate container filled it with water, and put it in the freezer overnight. Now before I added the ice, I took a laser temperature reading and it's in the upper 70s. Okay, the ice is hard now, so it's time to add it to our cooler chiller. Then I covered the top, plugged the fan in, and turned it on. And after a few minutes, I was getting readings in the upper 50s. Our cooler chiller is working. Down the road, I might add a solar panel for total portability. And that's how to make the DIY cooler chiller. Where would you use it? Tell us in the comments. I love making videos for you, and my friends at Audible.com help make that possible. In fact, Kip K fans can get a free download right now so you can try it out. Audible.com has over 150,000 audiobooks that you can listen to on your phone, iPod, e-reader, tablet, or even your computer. There's nothing like Audible.com. Great audiobooks in all kinds of categories. The latest book I've been listening to is A Game of Thrones, A Song of Fire and Ice. It's awesome. So, after watching this video, head over to audible.com and pick out your free audiobook. Go to audible.com slash kipk to get your free download. Thanks for supporting my show. You can check out more of my videos on my channel by clicking the box on the left. And for more easy projects like this one, click the box on the right. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.